Liverpool named Leonard Marshall. He was different from his kind. His life was a mystery. Every fifth of the fifth moon marks the red calendar of the Mad Leaders. This was strong forces that rule over Casloma. There was something that links this child with the great Mad Leaders. This is another phase of Splatter. What you're trying to tell me is that you and your friends were coming back from a party. And a strange woman crossed your path and started attacking you guys. Did you happen to see this woman? Like have a close view of what she looks like. She looked strangely pale and had a dark look of horror. It was my 20th birthday. We were all having fun. While celebrating, something happened. every man for himself. Every man for himself. He ran. He ran as fast as a less could carry. To no destination. All we could think of was run. Serena! Serena got stuck on the way. She was badly injured. We helped and managed to get her gone. We were all lost in the woods. <laughs> Patricia and Lewis were no longer with us. <laughs> Patricia! <laughs> scared me. We were completely separated. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> we, find it. <laughs> we had had doubt. Calm down. But just had to stay strong. Stay strong for one another.
Serena could no longer hang on. She was in pain. We got her to a point of where we rested. But there was something about this place. There was something. The wind. The sounds. I knew something was just not right. I felt it as my heartbeat. Strange things were happening. Louise, as if someone is following us. Patricia, there's no one here. I just couldn't place it. Someone is following us, Louise. Let's go. It's just your mind that's playing a fast one on you. Let's go. But that strike. Louise! <laughs> <laughs> the dark look on her face. <laughs> please, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I'm really shy. It was the madly dance. Did you hear that? We heard a loud scream from a far end. Something bad had happened. Did you hear that? It's okay, it's okay, let's go. Leo, 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 Leo! You stay here with Serena, okay? Let me go check it out. Sure, bro. Ramsey dashed off while I took charge of Serena. Be careful. Sure. Ramsey. The whole day was turning out to be a horrible one. <gasps> Survivor was not certain. We waited all day for Ramsey to return to us. Patricia! The night were now slowly uncovering its veil. Patricia! We could hear the echoes of the words we altered. Yes. Serene, Serene. Yeah. It's getting dark. And it's not going to be funny anymore. We just couldn't wait any longer for Ramsey to return. Because we didn't know what might have become of him. Come on, stand. Try. I'm trying. We prayed. We prayed for a savior to come away. But the more we walk, the lost we became. Serena got exhausted. She could no longer continue. I felt that pain. We got her to a stand. I see. I see shadows. I see. I see people calling. She was losing so much blood already. Why are you still can? 
Don't say that. We're living here together. I was not struggling to most of us. I hear voices. I watch as she struggle. She gave up. I felt the whole world has come to an end. I thought this was the judgment day. For some time I thought of Ramsey. Could he have returned to where he left us and not find us there? Those questions were irrelevant now. The bank. all that was going through my mind. I beg you! I beg you! I beg you! Those dark look in her eyes. She was merciless. Trying to play a tough guy. Let's see how long he hangs on that. The kid has not done it. I think he's saying the truth. There is more to this. I really do not believe any of this. We need to get to the root of it. Detective Oprah. This is the kid I raised. I know him. And he's my son. You and I know that the force is not about sentiment. We work with facts. I am getting you off this case. What? What's happening here? I want you guys to keep an eye on him. I need all the information about this case. Sir, what's happening? 